Hello, and thank you for viewing this post. Today, we're going to talk about six guidelines to create a truly successful and fearless life. Notice that I called them guidelines because when it comes to a plan for living your life and my life, there is no one size that fits all. In the past, we learned how to recognize a number of the factors, forces, and issues that interact with our goals and influence how we experience the physical world. We've also learned how to reconcile all of the above so they complement each other in creating a rewarding life that works for us. Hmm. We then discussed how to use this information to reconnect back into every circumstance and situation in our life. Now these six guidelines I'd like to share with you are these. Number one, commit now to fulfill your purpose and live your life. You have a specific function and purpose for living that only you can fulfill. Don't be anxious though if you haven't found your life's purpose yet. Sometimes we have to wait to gain more life experience before our purpose becomes apparent. In the meantime, stay connected to your spiritual nature and your true purpose will find you. Number two, identify the areas in your life that aren't working. Take a moment to list these areas that repeatedly cause you problems. Do they concern relationships, health, finances, authority figures, employment, or whatever? Ask yourself, what's holding you back in each of these areas? You gotta be honest and willing to face your fears as well as any hidden emotions. Remember, no matter how frightening these areas may, may seem, you're just dealing with paper tigers. Number three, create a list of personal values. This list of values should reflect and be integral with how you live your life. They should reflect an alignment between body, mind, and spirit. Number four, create specific, measurable, and time-oriented goals. Your goals should focus on providing as much value as possible. The truth is that people appreciate values and oftentimes will spend their resources in order to help you to meet your goal. Number five, trust the process. This process defined here cannot fail. You may have to vary the ingredients to obtain the results you desire. Remember, Thomas Edison failed over 10,000 times before he successfully created the light bulb. And number six, maintain an attitude of gratitude. Take a few moments each and every day to thank God for providing you the opportunity to succeed. Remind yourself of all the reasons, no matter how small they may be, that you have to be thankful. If you're having a problem doing this, please view my short video titled, how to create an attitude of gratitude. It's on the YouTube channel, and my channel on the YouTube is the Al0703. In conclusion, now is your time. Our set of beliefs and values are the most important possessions we have. They support and give us the strength and mindset to endure tough times. These values must be impeccable and independent of current fads or the whims of others. All of our goals, choices, and decisions should reflect our values. Our ethnicity, religion, age, finances, health, and other circumstances do not matter. We're able to have peace of mind and obtain the desires of our heart at any age. This information will work whether you're just entering the workforce or being forced to retire. You'll acquire whatever is necessary to achieve your goals by following these simple guidelines. The quality of life starts in our mind and manifests itself in the physical world. Henry Ford once said, whether you think you can or can't, either way you're right. Life's not as difficult as we think. We choose how we respond to life. Our spiritual, intellectual, and physical natures were not created independently of each other. They are inextricably intertwined. Seize the moment and the opportunity to achieve success. Do it right here and right now. I hope you enjoyed this post. And until next time, here's hoping that you live today and every day passionately and with purpose. Thank you and God bless.